Hello you beautiful people, welcome back to Shrine Watch, my name is Panda and today we're going to have a look at the perks on the Shrine of Secrets and take them into some games and see if we can absolutely just destroy everything. So you know how it works, let's take a little look at our survivor perks first. Our first perk is a Jane Romero perk, it's 10th time up on the Shrine, we have Head On. Now this has been on the Shrine quite recently so I expect you to kind of know what it does, but after getting into a locker and waiting 3 seconds this perk will activate. If you sprint out of it, you know, rushed action out of it, and the killer is in front of it, it will stun the killer and make them go bloody crazy. This will exhaust you though, so you can't pair this up with Dead Hard and Sprint Burst and things like that. Well, you can, but it's probably not going to go off. And when I'm playing killer, this is one of my most feared perks. I absolutely hate being head on and if you have an entire group of them, it's just an absolute living nightmare. But if you're playing solo and you get them off, you know, it is kind of fun, but uh, it's really, really annoying as the killer. Our second survivor perk is a Yui Kimura perk. It's third time on the shrine. We have Lucky Break. When you become injured, Lucky Break will activate and it stays activated whenever you are injured. And during this time, you'll leave no scratch marks and no bloods for that entire minute. So if you get injured and then you heal up after 20 seconds, you'll have saved 40 seconds of the perk. And then if you get injured again, it goes on and on. This is absolutely sick when compared with Iron Will because essentially you're leaving no scratch marks, you're leaving no blood, you're not making any sound and really the killer is just going to be confused. It's going to be really, really hard to find you and it actually you know if you pair it up with head on you can get some distance from the killer get into a locker wait for the killer to come and try and find you and then smash head on have a good laugh the killer disconnects from the game and over on our killer perks our first killer perk is a freddy perk it's eighth time on the shrine we have the very underwhelming fire up so for each generator completed, you get a stacking 4% buff that speeds up, picking up, dropping, vaulting, damaging gens, breaking walls, and breakable walls. Now this lasts for the entire game, but it really is... Maybe it's good in the current meta where the gens just get popped over and over and over, but essentially it just... You know, it's crappy early game. I guess late game, it's alright, but I really find this perk is a little bit underwhelming. I don't like to use it. It does speed up kicking gens, which is kind of nice, but... By the time it's actually stacked up and has a decent speed increase on kicking gens, the gens are already done, you know. You've got to get to like four gens before you really notice a big difference. Uh, so not my favorite perk. And our second killer perk is a plague perk. It's sixth time up on the shrine. We have corrupt intervention. When you enter the match, the three generators furthest from you will be blocked by the entity for two whole minutes. This means that if the survivors spawn miles away from you, they won't be able to work on those generators, they'll be completely blocked off, and it gives you a little bit of time to try and actually get in some chases before the survivors do all the generators. In the grand scheme of things, this really does slow the game down at the start of the game more than any other perk really can do. And after the two minutes, the entity stops blocking the generators and they can repair them. But hopefully in that two minutes, You've managed to get some pressure, some hooks, and, you know, get the game rolling. So there are perks, and what are my picks going to be? Well, if you're a survivor, I've got to say Lucky Break, because I feel like Lucky Break has got some actual good utility, you know? Enables you to get away from the killer when you get injured. Enables you to get away from the hook when unhooked, because obviously you're injured then. So you can get away, hide a little bit, maybe not get tunneled. Uh, head on, if you're a memer and, you know, you want to have some... Let's face it, toxic fun, because I find it pretty toxic, but that's because I'm a killer main. Uh, but if you want to have some fun with it, head on is a perk, but I've got to say Lucky Break, I think, is a bit nicer. And over on our killer side, there's no competition. It's definitely Corrupt Intervention, uh, one of those meta perks. They're probably going to nerf it in the great balance patch of 2022, but that's not coming for a while. So grab yourself Corrupt Intervention, slow those little survivors down and get some pressure. So let's grab these perks and take them into some games, and I think I'm going to play Survivor first and see if we can get some head-on value. It's probably not going to happen. Now, I'm absolutely loving the new preset thing. This shit is insane. I love it, and there's presets for perks, but then also for cosmetics, which I think is just badass. I can't believe it took them six years to add this in, but it's finally here. Uh, so we have our Shrine Watch build here, Lucky Break and Head-On. I'm going to use Iron Will to go with Lucky Break, but then also Quick and Quiet to go with Head On. But then they all actually work together. So you get injured, you run away. No blood, no scratches, no noise. Jump into a locker silently. Killer tries to follow you. Head on, smash, out you go. Killer's raging. GG. I mean, I guess that's, I guess that's what you want, right? And if we're talking about maps with lots of lockers, I'm gonna go for the game. We'll see how this goes. It could be an absolutely terrible idea. Uh, hopefully we get a dredge as well. 
I was having a lot of fun on my Dread stream last night over on Twitch. Had some really good games, felt like I was crushing, and then at one point, it just flipped, and the survivors were just absolutely destroying me, and it was really frustrating, if I'm going to be completely honest. Um, I had a real struggle with it, and I don't have these perks on the dredge, which is really annoying because I would love to play the dredge today. I do have cropped intervention. I, you know, fire up bloody sucks. Maybe I'll play some dredge. Okay, the game, obviously, because I burned the offering. Uh, where is the locker? Is it the dredge? Oh, shit, actually. The dredge kind of works against head-on because uh, we got to lock all the lockers. Come past here, Dredge. What could go wrong? Oh, it's going to be pretty hard to have him come past here. Uh, you know what? You know where I bet we can get... Jesus Christ. How many lockers are there on this map? What the fuck? There's like a million. Night is coming. I do actually really like this nightfall mechanic. I think it works really nicely. Uh, it's scary as the survivor. It's cool and helps you as the killer. Oh god, it's the bloody dredge. Okay, nice. And... Oh, We got him, boys. We got him. Head on value. Okay, and we hide. Honestly, it's going to be really tough for the killer to find us. Hey, Mia. Obviously, he's got no heartbeat in this mode. Fucking hell, it's so dark. I actually really like the darkness mechanic, though. It's kind of cool. It's... Bloody tricky to see the killer, though. Right, I kind of want to let my head on recharge. <laughs> he's sludging about down there. Uh, let's just do some generator. Uh, head on will recharge. Then I'll use it again. It'll be hilarious. The killer will say lol in the end game chat. It's going to be brilliant. Just you wait. That gen, honestly, dude, the gens at the moment just go so fast. I really don't know how the killers are meant to counter this. He's got no hooks so far. Shit, okay, well, we'll do an <laughs> we'll do another game after this. This does not count. Ooh! He's got no head. Has he got no head? He doesn't have no head. All right, I'm opening the gate and I'm leaving this place. Okay, well, that kind of was what my games were like on the dredge last night. <sighs> Towards the end, I just couldn't do a thing. I just felt so useless. Like seriously, like the killer looked enough like a giant penis before, but why the hell did they add in a skin that makes it even more pink and veiny? Like, it's disgusting. And I'm, it, it's hard to disgust me, but honestly, it's, Foul. Uh, fair play to them, though. You know, it's interesting, and they're definitely embracing the uh, just giant cock killer. Oh, the game again. Wait. Did I burn that? Shit. I didn't mean to. I guess I did. Uh, okay, well, sorry, killer. Let's see. A locker. Is it the dredge? Or is it... It's not the dredge. Okay, well, that's... Uh... Don't know. That's fine, I guess. Shit! Into the locker. I'll come back for it. Come back. Come back. Damn, look at that. That shit's insane. No, my lucky break's running out. Somebody heal me. I need to heal. I need heal stat. So it looks like I'm gonna lose. He's got corrupt intervention too. Looks like I'm gonna lose my lucky break here. Damn, yeah, definitely bring in a medkit. Seems to be the play. Uh, well, definitely the play, because Lucky Break's gone. Value. I guess value was gotten from it. It saved me one knockdown, but mm, I could have got more if I was smarter. Lockers in here? Oh, there's lockers everywhere. They've added so many lockers into this game. Bloody hell. Okay, well, I've got to say he's got quite decent pressure here. We've not done any gems yet. Interesting. Chunk away on this a little bit. Is he coming this way or going that way? Going that way. Okay. I don't think this gen's gonna pop. He's bloody coming. He's coming. 
Okay, run straight. Oh! Run straight into the trap. Come on, first time. No. God damn it. How have we got zero gens done? Every other game that I played, like, four gens are done by now. I guess that's nice for him. I'm happy for you, Trapper. I'm happy for you. Careful, 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 careful. Let me snap this. Oh. Okie dokie. What the fuck? Re oh my god. Maybe he'll knock her down and then come past here. He's gone too far away. Damn it. We did a generator. We're definitely escaping. Oh, for fuck's sake. No, no, no. I wonder if he's trapped this. Oh, no, he left. He left smart. Very smart. Nice. Okay. All right. It's all coming together. He's got Kindred. Thank you so much for using that incredibly useful team perk. I'll do you. He's bloody coming this way, Feng. He's coming this way, Feng. Stop moving. Okay, Ash, damn, Ash is on his last hook. I need to take a chase here. Oh my god. Lockers, give me lockers. I've got to get hilarious head on plays. Shit, it feels so, like I'm such a bully. We're praying. Didn't happen. Okay, well, respect to the trapper, honestly. He's managed to delay this game from going out of control for at least a while here. You can't see me. I'm Jeff. Been saved, bloody hell. Risky maneuvers. <gasps> the trapper! Uh, okay, two gens. Right, I want to do this gen in the middle room here. I've been trying to bloody smash this out all game. Kate, come here! Kate, come here! Oh my god. Kate, no! I've got head on, Kate! Maybe he'll come past me here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Fuck! Damn it, Kate! Come to the lock! I should have said before the game started that I had head on. Because we could absolutely have saved her there. Shit! Kate, you donked it! Oh no, 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 Kate! We're all gonna die. Oh, it's close. Uh, right. Any head-on potential here? Chase me! Chase me! <laughs> oh my God! What the fuck? <laughs> oh dear. Two gens left. They're healing up over there. Ash is over there. All right, maybe we'll survive this. Maybe we won't. I feel a little bit downtrodden since I can't get my bloody head on off. Okay, Ash is dead on hook. I think the trapper just stood in his own trap, which is absolutely hilarious. I love that. I love that about you, trapper. Can we get a lock? Dude, bro, that's... Pff. Some lockers are just everywhere, and some lockers, there aren't any at all. Come this way, Ash. Come this way. Yes, yes, yes. No. God damn it. I've spent most of the fucking game trying to get head on play instead of doing generators. I've literally could have done all the generators in the world. Chase me. Chase me. Chase me. Bam! Oh my god, epic! We got the head on play. Alright, now I'm gonna die. 
die. No, I'm gonna die. For sure. And fair play to him, honestly. I would kill me too. Hey, thing! Yes. Kill her. She's not taking a fucking hook yet. Nice. Nice. Good job, Feng. Proud of you. Beautiful. Ash. <laughs> oh, thanks, Kate. Appreciate you. No, Ash. Is he going to come? Ah, oh, he's picked him straight up. Damn. Well, it sucks to be you, Ash. Oh, are we going to do the mega body block? Oh, no. <laughs> he's pissed. Ash, do the recovery thing. Oh, my gosh. Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? Get up, my little buddy! Heal him! Holy shit! <laughs> what the hell is going on? Oh no! Oh no, everyone's dead. Everyone's bloody dead. Uh, Come this way! Come this way! Come this way! Come this way! Come this way, Kate! Oh my goodness. Come this way, Kate! Come this way, Kate! Oh my god. This was it, Kate! You could have totally saved yourself. And now we're all going to die down here. Maybe you'll come downstairs. There's no hook here. For God's sakes! The game was actually going pretty bloody well. Feng, I'll try and I'll try and save you. Fuck it. What's the worst that's going to happen? I get some blood points. Get down from there. Oh, oh, I see how it is, Feng. Got it. He hooked on the other end of the map. I mean, I guess that's kind of nice. Maybe he's going to come over here. We can do a head on. Nice head on into the hatch. Boom. Epic. Super hilarious. All right, give me the hatch. If we get the hatch now, I'll be absolutely amazed. <gasps> there it is! Yes! Beautiful. Well, we didn't get all the gens done, but we did get out of the game. Uh, and I actually got two head-on plays. Epic. Very good, very funny. Uh, I laughed a lot, I guess. Unhooked four survivors. Did I get this? I didn't get this. Uh, let's give me a GG. GG! God, I got more blood points than the killer. Holy shit. Uh, I guess those head-on plays paying off. Okay, so desperately hoping I can find Corrupt Intervention 2 and 3 here. Which would be the penis? No, let's be the doll. I really love the doll set. It's probably one of the coolest skins they've ever made. It's just so intricate and well done. Oh, man, it's crazy. And in first-person mode as killer, it looks amazing. Uh, right, so we've got Corrupt Intervention 1, which is only 80 seconds instead of 120. So, literally 40 seconds less power. But, I don't have Fire Up, but fuck Fire Up. Who cares about Fire Up? Let's give it a shot. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Uh, honestly, I've, after yesterday's games, I feel like I'm going to get hurt. I do really like this add-on. The Worry Stone, whenever they lock a locker, which they're, spoiler alert, always doing, uh, you can actually see them for six seconds, which is kind of sick. And this one's nice too, when all gens are done, so when the fifth gen is done, all the locks are broken. Because the locks are a real pain in the ass. If you've not played any Dredge yet, uh, it's tough when they're locking all the lockers. You know, it's to be expected, but it is tricky. Okay, we got my bullies in the lobby here. Let's see what happens. We are a creepy doll, dude. Looking so sick. I love it. I really love it. Look at this one. I hate that one. <laughs> I'm glad that I don't have to see that when I'm playing killer. But I really like the hands. Uh, let's attempt to give it to them. Uh, one thing is that you really have got to smash the locks. And I was really failing to do that yesterday. So let's see if 
by smashing all the locks as I see them. Obviously, it slows you down a bit, but it probably does help you out going forwards. We'll check it out. Let's see what happens. The dredge. All right, not... Poof. There's not so many lockers in this map. Actually, they did add some extra in, but there's still not millions. Uh, let's dredge it up. Let's dredge it up. So all my lockers are blocked off. Obviously, you can see the timer in the bottom right to see uh, how long they're locked for. Here we bloody go. It's dredging time. What's up, David? All right. We have our obsession. Okay, that's fine. Let's go for the obsession because we've got to save the best for last. So if I can knock him down swiftly. Son of a bitch. If we can get him down quickly, then we will uh, be in a good spot for the rest of the game, really. I'm a bit concerned about that generator. Like, just not... Let's go over here. Hi, David! Nice. That actually worked out beautifully. Uh, hit the dead hard, David. I'm waiting for it. He didn't do it. All right, we're going to pick him up. But first of all, we're going to stop this survivor who wants the bloody flashlight blind me. Get out of here, Jill. Let's get out of here, Jill. I'll hit you with my big sausage hands. Okay, that's fine. Pallet destroyed. David picked up. Pick him up from this side. She wants to come at me. She's going to have a tr struggle. Okay, well, not bad. Oh, blood. Jill's around. Jill! Where are you? Where did the blood go? I've lost track of it. Jeez, okay, right. We're actually getting some bloody pressure here. Three people injured? Yes, Meg. Hi, Meg. Jesus! Okay. Wow, that uh, locker there is really paying off. Like, completely destroys that loot. <laughs> right. Well. Oh, you did a generator, did you? Let's pop over here. They've locked this. Don't want to be in here. Don't want to be in there. Uh, let's just go back over here. Fuck it. The dredge is here. Hey, Bill. Hey, Bill. Uh, dredge is... Just gone to the edge of the map. Pretty hype. Uh, what are you doing over here, Bill? You're dying. You got dead hard? No dead hard. Wow. Is this what it's meant to look like? I swear it was a bit more color than this before. Uh, bloody hell, it's like I'm in grayscale world. Uh, but we can see all of the gens pretty simply. I wish I had barbecue on the dredge. Like, I'm really missing that. Uh, let's go check out up here. I'm coming. Bonk. All right, Jill. Wow, I actually got some insane pressure going on here. I am absolutely astounded uh, and very pleased. Is the basement here? No basement. Okay. Well, we'll just keep this going, honestly. One generator, only four hooks. Could be better, but it's something. Right. Let's go back over here. Honestly, I'm loving these lockers. They should know full well to just stay the hell away from those. Because uh, I think every single one of them has been messed up by it so far. Meg. Man, the gens are just not progressing. Hi, Meg. Oh, my God. <laughs> the pressure. The pressure is insane. Right, we're going to try and win this loop. Yes. Yes, yeah, Stretch. Eight stacks have stayed the best for last. Holy shit. Oh. Oh my god, I looked down. What an absolute noob move. Uh, right, well, guess who we're going to kill now? It's going to be bloody Jill. It's going to be you, Jill. There's no pallet there, Jill. Just going for the window, Jill. I'm coming to eat you, Jill. Is she going to get the window again? She did not. Okay, fair play. Right, I'm actually going to... Oh, David! Oh, you're the obsession? I don't want to kill you, David. Bloody annoying. Is he going to the basement? Let me out! Let me out! I love that. Honestly, I love that. Uh, I hate being stuck in there, but I do love the little animation. David. I'm just waiting for my nightfall to come back, David, and I'm going to eat you, David. He just doesn't seem to have dead hard, though, which is bloody weird for a David. Okay, Jen over there done. Holy shit. 
Holy shit, though. I just always forget how amazing Say the Best for Last is. It just stacks up so hard. As long as you're not attacking the obsession all the time, you're bloody laughing. Okay, I haven't had to break any locks here either. Like, manually. Who's here? Someone's here. Blood? Oh, it's David. I'm coming for you, man. I'm coming for you. It's a crime of opportunity. Ah, oh, this game's going pretty bloody well, honestly. Oh, the basement is in there? Damn, I could have got that basement earlier. That would have really helped out. Uh, three gens left. And I don't know if I'm going to get this hook. Get up there! Oh, God, that was close. Oh, more gens being popped. Right, I need to... Oh, for fuck's sake. That's so annoying. Oh, hello there, Bill. Uh, how can we defeat this Bill here? Let's go to this gen. Locker, even. Hello, sir. Bosh, up to seven stacks again. Literally just in the absolute munch zone. And who are we munching? We're munching Bill. We didn't take the window loot. <gasps> I'm behind you, Bill. Oh. Okay, well, I guess I'll just knock you down then. Unless you got dead hard. <laughs> Bonk. Jeez. The back and forth is unstoppable right now. Well, this is nice, honestly, because I was really struggling yesterday. Maybe I'm just playing against, you know, not as pro survivors, but love it. Dredge is here. Oh, my goodness. Jill's going upstairs. Hi, Jill. No, so close. Hey, Jill, remember that flashlight save you did earlier? Me too. Oh, fuck! I can't believe it. All right, third time lucky. Third time lucky. Nice dead hard, though. Slap. Okay, right. All right, not killed anyone yet, but you know the way that I play. I play in a way where I want everyone to get three hooks each. You know, I'm not interested in camping, not interested really in tunneling. I like it when the game's intense. Okay, so everyone's on last hook now. What a good guy I am. What a nice killer. Why doesn't more people play like I do? Am I seeing stuff here? No, all right, let's check out. Oh, fuck. That gen's off. Uh, right, it's time to start killing some people. I wish I'd actually brought in a Mori. All right, I see you there, friend. Locking down my lockers, is it? David! I found you, David. Okay, we're gonna kill David. It's over, David. It's over. Where are you running to? Seriously, just predicting which... Predicting which uh, lockers he's gonna go in there is just so fun. David! Oh, you got the pallet here, don't you, David? That's annoying. Uh, maybe this will work. Nope, that didn't work. Damn it. Oh, he locked it! Let me the fuck out of here, David! I hate you, David. Shit, they're really gonna be getting the last gens done. Uh, but it's okay, we've got Blood Warden. I'm not scared. Come back over. Nice. Back into Nightfall. Glorious. Okay, and we're using our killer ability. Alright, one gen left. Let's get David dead, and then it's the hunt. The hunt is on for the survivors. Uh, it should be quite doable at this point. Bam! Oh, shit. They got the last gen done. Up there. You. Oh, boy. All right, Bill, you're dead. Let's just get you eliminated from the game. Jill's down there. Go and eliminate, eliminate Jill after that. And then maybe they'll open the gates and I can get the Blood Warden play. That's the dream, at least. Oh, they opened it. <laughs> oh, they left already. Damn. Uh, right, well, we should be able to get the Jill at least. So that's nice. <gasps> Come here, Jill. Shit. She's definitely got dead hard, from what I remember. Oh, 
Right, how do we win this? Like that. Jill, you're going down, Jill. All right, GG. <laughs> GG, 11 hooks. I will absolutely take that. Uh, I would like to have got the Blood Warden, but I'll take the three. Uh, nice, honestly, that went pretty bloody well. Especially for the cornfield map, which I absolutely detest. Uh, so well done. Well done, me. Pat myself in the back. That feels good. I've got to say they didn't lock all the lockers. They could definitely have locked more lockers. Uh, but, you know, it is what it is. Let's give them a GG. Enjoyable. Unhook four survivors. Don't think I managed to do that. Okay, well, no GGs for me. That makes me sad. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Good game, Matt. Well, that is it for me. That is Shrine Watch for the week. I hope that you've enjoyed Shrine Watch the Perks. I will try and make a news episode this week as I failed to do so last week. Uh, but until then, if you've enjoyed the video, please, of course, leave a like. Subscribe if you are new to the channel and show a friend. Uh, and just have a great, great week. Reminder, I do stream four times a week over on Twitch TV. Lots of Dead by Daylight and fun live content there. So if you follow the link in the description and follow the stream, that would be fucking ace. Uh, have a lovely day, everyone. I will see you soon. Panda out.